Hi, I'm Sandra, and I'm here with Anya. I'm assisting her today with what projects? Robots. Robots, that's right. We're going to make a couple of different kinds of robots that can actually do what? Drawing. Yeah, they're going to draw. So we're going to start with one project that is incorporating a robot from your crate. So we have all the materials ready for this art bot. We have our robot already built. And then we have the board, the clips, and the magnetic wand already from the crate. And to make it into an art bot, we're going to include a marker, paper, and tape. So the first step is we're going to put the marker on the robot. And what we want to do is make sure that the tip of the marker lines up with the bottom of the robot. And then we're going to tape it in place. And then what we're going to do is take a fresh piece of paper and clip it onto the clipboard. Are you ready to have your robot do a little drawing? Mm -hmm. Okay. Pull it onto your wand. I'm going to go right in the middle. Go ahead. So now we're going to move on to the second robot project. This art bot is a little bit more advanced, but we thought it was very cool. We saw it floating around on the internet and thought it was worth a try. What you need is a cup. Three markers. We highly recommend the thinner, skinnier kind. Some tape. Masking tape is great because it's easy for kids to rip it. Also recommend googly eyes. And then you need a hobby motor and a battery pack. These you can pick up at a hobby store. And the hobby motor we picked up is a 6 volt DC. And the battery pack is going to require four AAA batteries. So the first step is we're going to take the markers and put them onto the cup like a tripod. Now what we're going to do is we're going to put the motor together. We're going to take the battery pack and thread it through the motor. You want to try turning it on and see what happens? Yeah, it's working. So now what we're going to do is we're going to put the battery pack and the motor on top of the robot body. You want to try turning it on and see what it does? Nothing yet, huh? What we need to do now is we actually need to offset the motor. So we're going to put a big glob of tape on the axle of the motor. What do you think? Is it missing something? It's missing eyes. It's missing eyes? All right. All right. Are we ready to try this out? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's get a big sheet of paper and try it out. So there you have it. We have a couple of art bots for you to try, to explore, and discover. We're so glad that you joined us. And join us next time at KiwiCrate.com for more hands-on fun. Thanks a lot, and see you later. Bye. Say bye. Bye.